Okay, where are we? Niagara Falls. Whoa. Niagara Falls. Slowly we turn, step by step. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. Well, welcome back to the East Coast series. We are here in Niagara Falls. We're gonna head out today, but what an epic day yesterday was, right? It was grand. Man, we saw the falls during the day and then went back at night when it was lit up with the different colors of lights. Spectacular. I'm stoked, I'm stoked. You know, so we're gonna head out here, get some gas and try to get ourselves down to Rhode Island, probably, probably Providence, maybe Newport, just depends on how much time we have, you know? Yeah, so hey, with that, Let's we better get, get on it. And get down See the road. You morning and a great ride here on this 90. It really, really is. You know, it's actually beautiful. Even though we're on the interstate, there's like so much beauty and rolling hills and farms and the cloud structure is amazing. Well, you know what? I mean, we're trying to make some time to get down to uh, Providence, but uh, let's get off here at exit 46. This is the 390 and uh, we're going to go down and, and check out the fingerlings. Yes, yes. Well, I'm looking forward to that a lot. So we'll see what this gives us over here. We have no idea. Yeah, we'll cut across on the 20. Could be the 20A or the 20, but it's it's the 20. And uh, we'll take that maybe just below Syracuse. Uh, so we may add a, an hour or so to the route today, but hey, we're going to have some fun. Yeah, that's what it's all about, right? Just doing weird and different things while we're cruising. Heck yeah, man. Hey, there's a red barn over there. And you know uh, why they became red barns? Uh, I, I think you told us a little bit ago. I don't remember. Yes, well, they used to paint them with linseed oil and a certain kind of oil, but they would put rust in them to make them turn red and be really weatherproof. So that's where they became red barns. Gotcha. So now they just paint them red just out of tradition. I, I see. I understand what you're saying now. Yes. Fun fact, fun fact, and uh, where are we? Let's head south on this uh, 390. There's a couple other bikes over there. And then we will cut across on the 20 as we uh, get down there. Probably about four or five miles down south here, and then we'll hang a left. Gotcha. Well, it sounds great. I'm looking forward to see what we find. All right, man. Well, let's uh, see these guys down the road. You got it. Down the road. Down the road. Just checking out some gear here. We're hanging out in Geneva, New York. And uh, hey, weather's looking great. It's not cold out, but you know, could rain. We'll see. Nice Geneva. Yeah, we decided to get off the uh, freeway there, the 90 to the 390, jumped on the 20. We've been cutting across the country here. These are the Fingerling Lakes. And so, stopped here to use the restroom at the visitor center. What a great run. Headed to Rhode Island. What a great ride. Hell yeah, brother. Hey, we hope you're enjoying this East Coast series. 
brought to you by Legend Suspensions. And we need that because we do thousands of miles a year and we do all kinds of terrain and all kind of weather and dirt doesn't stop us, so we need good suspension. And with that, we run the Axio High Performance Fronts and on the rear, we run the Revo Arc Remote Reservoir System. It's great, man. Back to the video. and Taco Bell in the same building. What'd you have? I had two tacos and a burrito, but you know when you're on the road, you just gotta do some stuff like that. Woo! Yeah! Where are we headed? Uh, we're, I don't know. We're gonna try to go to Rhode Island, but uh, we could end up in Massachusetts and in Auburn before. We'll see where the wind takes us today. Yeah, you never know. So we're gonna hit the road. Nice to, meet you. nice to meet you. Hey, we're here in Syracuse, New York. Um, had been passing some message, messages back and forth with some of our uh, folks out there. And this is Chip. What's your handle? Uh, CNY Glider Rider. So awesome, right? He couldn't come and meet us over there for lunch, so we did a quick turnaround and met him. Ooh. How long have you been following us? Uh, since like October, November. Awesome. Long. It's almost a year now. Well, sorry we can't ride, but next best thing, we just come over and meet you and say hello. I appreciate that so much. Thanks right for your support. Uh, and hey, could we get you to help us see you down the road? See, see you down, down the road. road. Pretty crazy, all those uh, highway patrolmen cruising up there. I don't know, like 10 or 15, I wonder. You said you caught some news on that? <laughs> they were chasing a librarian or something? Yeah, of course, you know, I was just kidding, but. Yeah, you know, so what, what, she got mad at someone that didn't turn their books in or something? Yeah, yeah, I don't so know. It was a librarian chase. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know what it was, but all the wildlife and the greenery and it's really nice today and the weather's been it's a little cool which is perfect riding weather we're kind of bundled up you know i've never uh, been on the upstate new york interstate system right pretty interesting pretty cool pretty green a lot of uh, foliage um and, but one thing we don't really show a lot is one thing you have to do on these road trips is get gas yeah and you and josh i don't know what's happening but i've got like 40 miles less every time every stop really so my bike is just eating it up not sure what that is, bud. Uh, maybe you're on the gas a little bit more than we are. I don't think so. We're going to try to get into Auburn. Uh, try maybe. to get into Auburn? Yeah, we were trying to get into Rhode Island, but it's been a little bit of a longer day. Taking that 20 took a little bit out of us. Yeah. Well. <clears throat> Time-wise, not riding-wise, just time-wise. I, I mean, I'm looking forward to dinner and a nice drink and uh, relaxation and just going through what we did today. and. We got a few days ahead of us too, which is going to be awesome. Well, yeah, I mean, we're going to get down to whether today or tomorrow, we're getting down to Rhode Island, go down to Newport. We're going to meet Mary uh, and Zach, and then we're going to fly up Boston. You know, get up to 
Lub- Lubbock if we can. If we can't get that far, fine. But a we've, bunch of places that we've never, I've never been. It's going to be know? amazing. And uh, that is cool. And that's one thing I like about this trip, too, is because we're, we're already, like, our minds have been blown all the way along here, and there's more to come. Can't wait. Today and we're uh, now the sun is going down. We're on the 90. We just transitioned. We went 90, 87, 90. We are headed into Massachusetts here. A few miles. LC, you got your ears on. Yeah, how many states have we ripped through? Well, we'll end up, I guess, four by the time we get into Massachusetts. Wow, you know, it is really, really incredible. It's I, I kind of like this cool weather. We haven't been in cool weather for a while. Kind of in these rolling hills and there is traffic on this interstate, but you know, you kind of still, the scenery so good. We've seen a lot of deer on the side of the road as well. We sure have, and you know, I don't normally like the interstates, but I gotta tell you, this 90 has been beautiful. Yeah, it's it's got a lot to offer, and we did jump down, and we went on the 20 for a while. I know that, that they've already watched it and enjoyed that part of it, so we got to enjoy it as well. Well, we did take a little bit of extra time. That's where why we're back on this uh, interstate. But it's super green. But then there's these little sprinkles of the leaves that are starting to change. So in the next few weeks, it's going to be really spectacular through here as well. Yeah, and, and who knows what it's going to be like as we get towards Maine. Uh, yeah, I'm hoping that uh, we've hit it about right. Hopefully as we get further into Maine, we'll get a bunch of colors. But if not, I'm sure it'll still be beautiful. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's definitely interesting, and I'm blown away with how many toll roads there are. <laughs> well, what did the guy say the other day to us? Welcome to uh, welcome to New York. <laughs> but it's welcome to Milwaukee, or, you know, Wisconsin. It was welcome to Ohio. I mean, we've had toll roads virtually the whole way along here. Right, right. So, hey, I guess that's how we uh, make a little bit of dough. Yeah, I mean, we've never been on the East Coast, and we're really getting close to it now, aren't we? That's right. Hey, these Harleys have been uh, acting pretty well for us, uh, these demo bikes, the fleet bikes. Yeah, it's kind of interesting being on bikes that aren't ours, but you know what? This kind of trip, we were flew into Milwaukee, and it was like, hey, you know, let's get some bikes and, and do something different. So that's what we're doing. Yeah, well, I think we may have a little bit of a problem in the Anderson household. Why is that? Because she likes the seat? She likes the seat with the <laughs> armrest. So I know Laura's had your tour pack before, but, you know, we may both have to get two-lane life to figure out a way to get a couple tour packs for us that are, have armrests on them. Well, I got an idea. What if we have two uh, limiteds and we uh, use those when we take our wives and then we have our... Uh, our jalopies for uh, our solo trips. Well, if you can afford that, then maybe you could get me one. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, I guess we're not there yet, but maybe one day. <laughs> yeah, one day we'll get our fleet going. But hey, this has been great. You know, we're gonna have a great night tonight. We'll get in, get some grub in us, uh, enjoy the evening as we always do. We'll joke around, have some fun. Uh, hopefully we can get a little filming of the food done and, and do that uh, in a good good way. But uh, I'm just stoked to get get our way into Massachusetts. Yeah, you know, we snuck in a little Taco Bell lunch today, didn't we? The gourmet tacos of fast food. And then what happened? We had uh, uh, one of our subscribers wanted to meet us but couldn't, but told us where he was and was a couple blocks away, and we went over and checked it out. Uh, he wanted to ride with us today, but he ended up working, and we didn't know what time we were gonna, going to be places, so 
But it was nice. We, we drove over there. It was only half a mile away or a mile away and met him. Yeah. He was really stoked on that. <laughs> Little surprise. I guess men our age using stoked, you know? I don't know. Are we stoked on that? I'm stoked on life. <laughs> <laughs> We're shaking hands with America, baby. Hey, look it. Here comes a toll right here. Boom, 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 boom. Boom. Sorry, Harley. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, hey, let's... Uh, Let's get into wherever we're going. Yeah, we may get to Auburn. We were trying to get to Providence, but uh, it's getting a little late, and I think the girls are getting a little hungry, so maybe Auburn, but uh, yeah. All right. Well, I'll see you down the road. I'll see you down the road. Down the road. What a great day, but nothing like at the end of the day, sitting with great people, eating awesome food. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got to work on your food etiquette. No, I, I mean, you like, had tacos dripping um, out of your mouth the other day. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, what a, what a cool day. Um, you know, we took a little more time getting here because we went down the 20. You're, You're good. good. Um, and then we stopped off in Springfield, Massachusetts. Uh, don't know where we're at exactly, but they're West West Springfield. Okay, okay. All right. Okay. Uh, you know, we're at the Longhorn, and we're grabbing some grub, and we'll get to bed early, and then we'll go meet some friends tomorrow down in either Newport or Boston. We'll figure that out after dinner. I mean, there's so much ahead of us. There's so yeah. many great things we're going to see. We're already like mind blown as it is. But we're not done. We're just starting. Yeah. It was, right. it was the week has flown by. Absolutely yes. flown by. Right. Yes. And Your favorite part so far? Uh, um, the whole, I, I can't pick one. I just I, I told Laura earlier today, I have just loved this trip so yeah. far. I mean, awesome. everything, everything. You were saying, but we have. Oh, I was going to say, we've been through seven states so far. Seven states in two, day, two days? Three days? Three yeah. days. Is three. it seven? Yeah. yeah. So we counted. Seven we figured, all right, seven. seven. states. Niagara Falls was probably my favorite, although Sandusky was pretty yeah, awesome. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's, yeah. it is hard to choose. Um, we rode a long time today, but we did it, and these guys are awesome. They, all three of them, just know how to get ride us. Hard, ride hard, right? safe, ride right strong. strong. <laughs> yeah. All right, we're riding strong. Yeah. And you know what? We got our pal Josh over there behind the camera, and... He's looking at our food, even though I know he wants his food. Yeah, Josh. What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> so let's get to the grub. We've got some steaks. We've got some chicken wings. We've got chicken fingers. We've got broccoli. We've got baked potatoes. Let's get to it. We've got some yeah. yum for the tongue. Yep. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> so we'll see you after we eat. Whoo, what a great night. Great night. Great end of the day. We're tired. We're beat. We're long time on the road. This is Jim Stevens, uh, Two Lane Live TV tonight with a special report. Tell us, Jim. Well, we've driven about uh, or ridden about 1,090 miles, 1,100 miles in two and a half days. Now, that's the miles. That's not bad. Not bad. We've seen some great sights. Awesome sights. And we have more to see. So we've seen Sandusky. We've seen Niagara Falls. We're now in Springfield, Massachusetts. Not where we wanted to get today, but we'll get there tomorrow. Yes. Which is Newport, Rhode Island, up to Boston, and then we don't know from there. Could so be we're Portland, kind of Maine. Going up the coast. We're going up the coast. Once we get down to the coast. Right, right, right. So yeah, what do you have to say, man? Show Great us. Day. Tell us. Tell us what's Great up. Great times. We're gonna meet Mary from Legends and yes. Jack. Yep. They want to yeah. come and finish up the trip with us, so. Good times had by all. Good times had by all. I mean, you know. So how do we close this thing out? Do uh, you want to tell them anything? Yes. What would you tell America if you could say one thing? Get out and travel, shake hands with America. But hey, while you're doing that, subscribe to our website, subscribe to our YouTube channel, tell your friends because. Thumbs up, mash the bell, give us a comment, and hey, for those of you that are new, welcome. And for those of you that have been with us, which we've met a few of you on this trip, 
Thanks for the support. Love meeting people on trips. Love it. So see you down, down the road. road.